Hello, are you moving to G Suite? In this video, we will show you how our industry-leading platform migration was can help. We will demonstrate how simple it is to migrate to Gmail. First, a little history on BitTitan. We were founded in 2007. We have 43,000 customers worldwide. We have serviced over 19 million users, and we are present in over 187 countries. MigrationWiz is our industry-leading migration platform that helps IT professionals assess, deploy, and manage cloud solutions with greater profitability. MigrationWiz helps migrate multiple workloads to G Suite. This includes mailboxes, files and documents, and even archives. We support many different types of sources and mailbox migrations. For example, things like Lotus Notes, Exchange On-Prem, Office 365, and even IMAP and POP3 environments. We will now show you how easy it is to migrate a mailbox into G Suite using our platform. First, we're going to click Create Project. Now you can see that it's asking you to select your project type. From the options below, you have Mailbox Project, Document Project, Public Folder, Personal Archive, and Collaboration. I would like to point out that BitTitan and MigrationWiz offers a single solution to migrate all workloads to the cloud. This would include workloads to G Suite for Mailbox, Document, and Archives. Today, we're going to focus on a Mailbox project, so we're going to select Mailbox. Then we need to create a project name. Then we need to select the customer. If you have not created a customer yet, you're going to want to select New. From here, we select the customer in our drop-down menu. We click Next. Then we're going to create our source endpoint. Select Source Office 365 Tenant. Then we're going to select our destination tenant. This is going to our G Suite with our API tenant. Now, I would like to point out that we use the Google API because it gives us increased migration speeds, better performance, and enhanced security. Once you've selected your endpoints, you're going to hit Save and go to Summary. From here, you can see what type of migration is supported as far as items available for migration. Source is Office 365. Your destination is G Suite using the API. I would also like to point out that this gives a direct link to our knowledge management site as well as our support for any migration guidelines, frequently asked questions. So we have a very accessible documentation and support that's directly integrated into our UI as well as you've basically already created your project from end to end and that only took just a couple of minutes. Now I'd like to show you how to add users and perform a migration. From here, we're going to add our users. I'm basically just going to add from my portal, select users, and click add. Now that my users are added, I'm going to verify credentials. Click start, verify credentials. This tests access on both sides. Now that the verification is complete, we're going to select a pre-stage migration pass. This will pre-stage the data to the destination. Now, as you can see here, you have the ability to select just the mail, it's only going to migrate the mail, and select a 30, 60, or 90 days. We recommend 90 days. This will pre-stage the data to the destination from 90 days and prior to backfill the mailbox. We're going to click Start Migration. Now that the pre-stage is completed, we're going to want to run a full migration pass. This will get the rest of the mail data, calendars, and contacts. You'll select Start and Full Migration. From here, you'll see that contacts, calendars, and mail are all selected. We're going to hit Start Migration, and it will migrate the remaining data left in the source mailbox. As you can see, the mailboxes will continue to migrate until completion. This now concludes our video of migrating a mailbox to Gmail. If you'd like to get started migrating today, please be sure to contact your preferred distributor or visit us at bittitan.com and you can start migrating your mailboxes to Gmail.